President Joe Biden said he hopes there will be a ceasefire in the Israel-Hamas conflict by next Monday. Sources familiar with the discussion say Hamas has backed off some key demands, bringing the negotiating parties closer to an initial agreement that could halt the fighting and see a group of Israeli hostages released. In the U.S., many eyes are on the Michigan primary today, which will, in part, serve as a litmus test on Biden's refusal to call for a ceasefire in Gaza. The president's ardent support for Israel has enraged a large block of American progressives, many of them Jewish and Arab Americans, most notably in and around the Michigan city of Dearborn, home to one of the largest Arab American communities in the country. That anger is fueling a statewide movement among Democratic critics of Israel for voters to mark uncommitted on their ballots.